a lot. I'm proud of it. I'm glad. I'm real pleased to get it cleaned up. It's been a long time coming. <laughs> sure has. For Bob Wallace and neighbor Troy Hess, this mountain of tires and trash is more than a nuisance. It's affected the way they've lived for years. See, we can't, we can't use our patio or nothing because of the mosquitoes. And it's those mosquitoes that are causing most of the problems. I've been fighting mosquitoes. We don't have just a few mosquitoes. They're, they're, when you walk out the back door, there's a black cloud of them. The main reason for the biting bugs? Piles upon piles of tires. But it's not just tires. The city of Belton believes there could be several cars hidden underneath all of this junk, and they're afraid that could tack on the price to the cleanup process. And so the council authorized us to spend up to 25000 And we told them we're not absolutely sure it will cover that, that uh, all the cleanup will can be done for that, but we hope it will be. And that's going to be the catch because it's going to take a lot more than $25,000 to clean that place up.